this week on the Hoover Boys. I think another one. What the <laughs> hey, right? Yeah. That sounds beautiful. Hey, um. There's a point of I've ever heard of one. One real. Yeah. Ooh, Tight. Well, today we're back at our farm that was established in the 1660s. And we've already found a few things this morning. What else is there to say? Let's go have some fun. What numbers you got, B? 83 to 85. Sounds like a copper to me. Two reals. Of course, we just got here. Is the very first signal. Anything? I don't know. Let's check. Hold on. See, don't don't keep stabbing it. Here, let's see if I hit on the probe. I cannot. Where are you going? Oh, thought it was over that way. Oh, that's pure. All right, the moment of truth. Oh, what is that? Oh, <laughs> hey, it's a badge of some sort. It is a badge. That could be pretty cool. Yeah. I don't know. You nailed it, buddy. Uh, you flow okay. inherited it. I flow inherited it. That's interesting. It's a little badge. It says Capital Washington. It's got the Capital on there. No idea about that one, buddy. Hey, something though. It's it's cool. That just you know, if somebody missed that signal, <laughs> they missed a oh, copper wow. signal. <laughs> Maybe they just didn't touch this field. That's what I'm hoping. I mean, this field's nice. Good job, buddy. I haven't got a signal this good in a far field in a long time. I'm, I'm calling silver on this one. Listen to this. It's, it's too good. It's too pure. Four reals. You heard it here first. It's too pure. You see it? Ooh. Huge copper. <laughs> Be a big fat old one. No rotten bazinga. Oh, well. Liberty. Uh, I'm gonna say braided. I think it's a braided. Yeah, they always beep high like that. There's a good sign. <laughs> Copper. This early in the morning. <laughs> Yeah, buddies. Come on. Let's have some fun today. Yeah. Hey, your copper drought's done. It is! I had like a two-week <laughs> copper drought. Mwah! <laughs> washing machine, that thing. Well, this soil doesn't look like it's going to be too kind back here. It is a braided hair large scent. I looked at it with my loop. It looks like an 1850. These ran up to 1857. So that's awesome. Right off the bat, got me a large scent. Mmm! -hmm. And it's probably going to be a good day because it's windy and we only have good days when it's really windy outside and I'm sick, so whatever. Let's have some fun. Leo, you playing with us today, buddy? Yep. <laughs> we got to be loud. It's too windy today. Yeah, yeah. Anybody got a button yet? Uh, Bill got a button. Okay, good. That's a pretty fat one. Mm. How was it beeping? It was uh, 80, 81. 81, huh? It was weird. It was, it was up on the side. I'm not sure what we have here yet. Hopefully we can ID it. It's a great sign though. Big old fat copper, buddy. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it looks like it's going to be one of those toasty fields. At least we have an ID. That's the wreath. That's the back. It is a matron head. Uh, barely see the outline of her on there. I could see it when we were trying to get the dirt off. That's a great sign, man. You got anything else? Uh, just a piece of utensil. I don't know if it's fork, spoon, knife. That looks early, man. It's real thin, too. I got a uh, tobacco tamper. 
Oh, you did? Yeah. Awesome. You see, that's where they packed the tobacco, and they used this tea. to scrape out the uh, the bowl. That's a golf tee. It's, it's a golf like tee. It. it is not. It is a piece of history. You got something, Bill? Billy? You tell me. It's a little one. Sink on the back. That thing is tiny. Now, what the hell is that? <gasps> that looks War 1812, brother. Yeah, dude, that's what I'm thinking. That's my first, if that is. Broken shank. Yeah. Oh, that is beautiful, man. That's what I said. It might be 1820s. This pattern no was. It came out in like the War 1812, like the early 1800s, but yeah. I think they used it up to like 1830. That is beautiful. I know. That's probably the oldest thing we found here yeah. so far. Nice. I love it. Boom! Good job. I gotta, I gotta investigate this well, little stream. Close to the water. This way. Oh yeah! Oh yeah! yeah. I've dig another one. What the <laughs> hey, right? Yeah. This sounds beautiful. Hey, um. There's a point of I've ever heard one. One real. Yeah. Cool tail. Tight. Look at your shadow. Silver. Copper? Huh? Copper. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah, buddies. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh, man. What do we do to deserve days like this? Oh, it's a KG2. It is it a KG? Yeah. Sweet. Easy. One wiper. Wow. How does that turn out nice? And the matrons and the braiders are disgusting. <laughs> I don't know, man. That's awesome. awesome. Yeah, that's a nice one right there. King George II. Even, even think I have a date coming through there. It looks like 1730. These are 1729 to 1754. So I'll make it a second year if it is a 1730. That is awesome. It's gonna be a good day today. I had that feeling. Your turn again, buddy. I knew we should have came down. This is where I was when Leo called me over to get his coin. See everything in the center? Uh, yeah? Maybe. You got yourself a copper. Yeah. Unspanking real. First copper of the day. Maybe. Definitely got something on there. Yeah. I think it's US. It is. One cent. <laughs> I think you have another matron. Yeah. I Fair think. You are. You were the only one who found coins here last time. <laughs> yeah, I know. We were in the front field. I believe that's what you have here, uh, buddy. Another matron? I believe so. That's cool. That's what she looks like to me, buddy. <laughs> Boom. There's gotta be some old silver back here. Well, we've done this before. We know there doesn't have to be. Nothing? Junk metal. Yeah. Let's just hope. Yeah. Hopefully we can get that 1700 silver bed out of the way, finally. <laughs> well, I just dug the signal I got before Bill called me over, and I got an awesome button. I got another military button, guys. Another War 1812. This is awesome. Unfortunately, it's got a little plow kiss. It's going to be hard to get it in the sun, but it's an eagle on top of a cannon. It's an artillery button from the War 1812. You can see the cannon there, the cannon wheel. That's incredible. Oh, I like this stuff better than coins. It's always nice when you can get a field that has good buttons in it. Most of the buttons we find have no historical value, but that certainly does. I just flipped that something around. I thought it was a button, so I started cleaning it up. Ends up being a two cent piece. Sorry, Bobby. It's in not the greatest of shape, but there's the shield. It actually flips wrong. It flips like this, and you gotta rotate it. There'd be the wreath and the two cent side right there. It is toasted to heck. Usually these things hold up better because they're like the same composition as the Indians. They're like a bronze, but not out of this field. Toasted two cent piece. That is sweet. Sorry, Bobby. Well, I got a nice little signal here. The guys are kind of far away, so I'm going to try a one handed live dig. Sounds pretty pure. 
hopefully I dig in the right spot. Uh, kaboom! Now the fun part. Still in there. Anybody home? Anybody? Of course, I had to take my gloves off. Alright. Anybody? We have it. I got the D. Big old D buckle. A lot of signals back here. There's not a whole lot of trash. Exactly what we wanted. Look at that mess. Are you grazing? <laughs> what do you got, buddy? That's a different size. Oh, yeah. That's not even, like, round. Mm -hmm. Hammered? Mm -hmm. Definitely see a bust on there. Huh. That's weird. That side wipes smooth. You can see what's going on on this side. I see Javis. Uh, that's gotta be George Javis. Oh my god. Dude, I think it's a William. Yeah. You mean, yeah. I don't really know what that is. I know you don't know what that is. I think it's a William the Third. Yeah. You know, it's, it's, that's early, right? It's 16th? like like late 16s, early 17s. Let me get a good look at this thing. <laughs> this thing has been beating around for a long time, buddy. Yeah. There is nothing on this side. But it's definitely a William the Third. You see the MVS on the left side of the bust, and the TER is on the right side of the bust. These are like 1694 to 1701, I believe. So this is probably your oldest coin ever. It definitely is. <laughs> Told you this place was 1600s, B. Yeah, you saw I only flipped the flat paper when it came down. That wasn't that deep, dude. I mean, this thing was definitely lost in the 1700s with all that wear, but oh, yeah. that's a 1600s coin. <laughs> Absolutely. Congrats. You better be. My turn. Just scored another military button to Eagle. I believe there would have been an A there. I think it's an artillery button. It's chewy. It's a one piece. It's a little convex. It's like 1820s, 1830s. Pre-Civil War. Ugh. Wish it was in better shape. But we saved it. Leonidas? Indian! Thing beat. <laughs> it's official, it is beat. It's like my deuce. Man. And you see how, like, nice Billy's William the Third white? Yeah. And this is just chunk. But it's definitely an Indian. Good job, buddy. Thanks, sir. Any buttons? Anything else to report? No. No? Just a bunch of junk. Yeah. This place is awesome. Yeah, it is. Alright, I need another high tone. Yep. Well, the guys are way over that way. I finally found that high turn I was looking for. Listen to this. Doesn't sound deep. See we hit it on the probe. We can. That's good. Come on. Be a coin. Be a coin. Ah. Let's get it. That might be something bigger. Nope. Kappa! <laughs> yes, sir. It was beeping like the uh, braided hair from this morning. Uh, here comes the wind. Let me try to figure out what this one is. That is awesome. Ew! It's pretty gross. That's the reverse. It is another braided hair. You can barely make out the back of her bust there, facing left. Uh, that's a smoothie. That's a smooth braided hair. That thing was circulated for a long time. Another big copper, though. Mm -hmm. 
Hopefully there's more out here. We don't have a whole lot of time. I don't think we have much past three o'clock because the lady has other things to do today. <laughs> you alright? Bill's dying again. again. I, think, I think we did pretty good for just uh, four or five hours at that place this morning. We showed the lady everything we found so we can come back anytime. Pretty pretty good field trash wise. I mean there was some shotgun shells and some modern bullets and some wire and typical stuff but there's a lot of old stuff back there too. Billy boy? Yeah. You got umbrella slide? Yeah. Old spoon handle? Got a bunch of buttons? That being your best? That needs some side light or something. There's a lot decent details on there. Mm. Pretty. And you got that. Your capital. What does it say? DC. Yeah, that's cool. And coppers. You got the matron head. These coins were pretty toasty out of there. That's disgusting. But this is this is nice. The William the Third. That might be a farthing. It's how much smaller it is than the the large cent. Leo. Is that a button? Musket ball? Some pottery? Buckle? That looks early. Some sort of spoon or fork handle. You got a little D. A this is a weedy? A memorial. Memorial? Yeah, and then a weedy. And a weedy? And a, and you got the Indian. toasty Indian. And that is a matron, believe it or not. That thing is really <laughs> toasted. Ugh. Here's all my goodies. Got a Vicks vapor rub bottle. <laughs> Some chain, I got the big D, little pieces of stuff. I got a couple umbrella slides. I don't know what this is, but it definitely has fancy on it. No idea. Got two thimbles. This one's absolutely enormous. It's got the old lead top. Got tobacco tamper. And nine buttons. A couple of the smaller ones have some design. And this one wore 1812 artillery. And that's an eagle, one piece. What is that noise? I think it's a weed wagon with four wheels. <laughs> Got a two cent piece, uh, two braided hair large cents, and the King George II. It's weird, like the older coins out there came up nicer than the newer coins. <laughs> but that was our day, and I got a Timex. <laughs> did you guys have fun? Yes, we did. It was nice seeing you today, Leo. Nice for me to get out. I'm it sucks that the day was cut a little short, but what are you gonna do? Until next week, help clean up the ground, dig it all, and take your trash with you. Why? Because all holes matter. Because <laughs> all holes matter. Really? <laughs> really? You didn't, you didn't really? jump up to the game, so I took it. Did you, you let you let the new guy steal your line? I had to let the guest do it. The guest. <laughs> you know, all the guests want to save my line. Yeah. Yeah. Leo's slimming down. Yeah. He's, he's looking lean. He's homeless. I'm homeless. <laughs> <laughs> the truth is, we just picked him up, you know, by the uh, thrift store. Yeah. New clothes. Like, hey, he's got a blue hat on. What's that guy up to? So. Look at he's got his hood on under his beanie. <laughs> hey, that's true. We got no hair. That's good you shave that mop off. <laughs> we don't have to get any more comments about why is Bill losing his hair? Uh, we're just trying to figure out what that stain is. Yeah, condor hit him. <laughs> <laughs> Sterodactyl turd. I ran out of toilet paper. Leave me alone. I want that. I know. Will you, will you take go, go offer that guy some money? You, you need that for nap time. Yeah. That'd be your perfect little nap sack shack. <laughs> shack. <laughs> nap sack shack. Oh man, that'd be perfect. It why would be. Need, why does that thing need dually wheels? <laughs> Boy, what do you think? Oh. It's a whole oh. What do you think? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's it. We got. We got. Had to bring it up. We got to get you one of them, buddy. Yes, we do. Looks like the A team. Oh, they're oh, blocking my on, shot. Come on, I want that thing. Come on. Oh well. Oh. Beat the horn. There it is. There you go. It's so it's red, white, and blue too. I know. Bobby would love it. Yeah, because he wouldn't see you because he'd be napping all day. <laughs>